Hi there, in this video I'm going to show you how you can download Dances for Student. So on your search engine just uh, search uh, Ansys uh, Student. This page will appear. We will go with the first option that say Ansys uh, Student version, free student software download. Click on that. Then this page will appear. Click on free download now. Then here, before downloading, just uh, scroll down to check on the system and uh, browser requirement. Click on this uh, plus sign. So here you can see, without the ANSYS Discovery, you will need a 4GB RAM. But uh, with ANSYS Discovery, you will need uh, at least 8GB RAM. A license is going for 12 months so this one will be expiring uh, 2024 end of January once you have met all those requirements click on download uh, ANSYS student 2023 R1 then download will begin shortly once the download is complete go ahead and do the extraction of that original downloaded file as the extraction is taking place, I uh, think I uh, spare some of your two seconds to hit that subscribe button. The value you are going to get from this software compared to your two seconds uh, is unmatched. So just support the channel by hitting that subscribe button. Then now, uh, the once the extraction is complete. can go ahead and delete this uh, original downloaded file just to create more space on your on your disk uh, that will give you more space on your disk go ahead and right click on the setup file then uh, run as, ad as a administrator and remember to agree with the terms and condition there then click next so here in case you want to change the installation directory then uh, you can go ahead and click browse so for me i'll go with uh, an another installation directory that is disk d because if you check the space requirement um, it would need like roughly 48.5 gb to install so that one is also one of the factors you should consider if you click next then uh, installation process will begin shortly this also might take a while to install depending on the the performance of your of your machine so patience is key another another thing which is key is your subscription so once the installation is complete, on the lower left corner of your screen, uh, on the search panel, just uh, type Workbench. If you type Workbench, uh, you can see you have the option of uh, launching uh, Workbench 2023 R1. You can as well create a shortcut uh, on, the, on the desktop. So here just click uh, allow, allow access. This will uh, enable you to enjoy full, um, full features of this software. Click again allow access. Then uh, here you have the option of saying yes and uh, also saying no. For me I'll go with the no option. Uh, it's not a must. And in case uh, you face any difficulty during the installation process, you can let me know in the comment section. Otherwise, uh, thanks for watching and let's catch up in the next video. Bye. Bye.